Well, this group of paintings that I've been working on this spring took inspiration from a number of different sources. I've been looking quite a lot at blue painted porcelain, both uh, Chinese and English porcelain. And also looking at some surrealist works by the British painter John Bunting. And he particularly did a famous uh, series of zebrachrome prints which interested me. At the same time I came across a couple of tubes of vintage oil paint which was a china blue colour so there seemed to be some convergence of ideas around making paintings which were blue. So I set out in the early spring to uh, make a series of pictures which were sort of decorative and inspired by those sources that were about a kind of a spring in a more pagan sense. I sort of had in mind as well uh, Stravinsky's Rite of Spring, which is, which is a piece of music which, which always stirs me. So there's a sort of convergence of ideas there which uh, then led to this uh, series of paintings using China blue, which is also known as, as Prussian blue. And the paint has a particular quality in that you can get very, very delicate light shades where the, the paint almost seems to change colour slightly. And these very, very dense areas which are very, very black and almost impenetrable with respect to the, to the light reflecting of them. So as a colour it gives you a huge amount of tonal versatility. So that's the story of these paintings really. And once begun, they're oil painted onto prepared paper which is prepared with a gesso base and the, the gesso base is a flexible but slightly absorbent surface so it's prepared with a very delicate pink dye and then applied to the paper. This is an impervious surface so that the oil will stay at the surface of the, the gesso and not sink into the paper so it makes it technically a very very stable base for oil painting. And then the pictures were sort of improvised one after another, one leading to another in this sort of pagan sort of spring. So that's the, the theme. And again, picking up on the surrealism of Banting and the, the decorative elements of, uh, of, of porcelain, but mixing it all together with the imagery that I've become uh, associated with.